Okay, God bless. Now, I think this is going to be my last prophetic word concerning maybe the years of 2011, 10, or 12. Um, because during those years, you know, God was speaking to me in a mighty way. And now we're in 2013, so he has new words to give um, me and from me to you. Okay, now um, this word is concerning... Uh, I don't have the book right in front of me, front of me at us as we speak right now, but um, in my prophetic journal, the Lord has showed me a nuclear bomb that is going to explode on this country, and I believe this was in either Nevada or you know I don't know, but this was a nuclear bomb, and it felt like it was in a desert. That's why I choose to say Nevada. That doesn't mean it was in Nevada. But I was in a desert. Okay? Not only I was in a desert, but, um, you know, it was a lot of saints. Okay? Now, first, when I had this dream, it was initially like in this house. Okay? Now, when this bomb went off, okay, it blew the windows out. And this house was a sanctuary. And it blew the windows out. Okay, now the wind when it blew the windows out, it blew the windows out and the, and the glass started flying, you know, like inside. Or it just burst it, okay? And it was me and a lot of saints, okay? And uh, after that, we, it's like we were placed in like a, um, or it's like either, I just want to say it's like that house either we were placed in or that house became a warehouse at first like I said it was a small little sanctuary house type setting but it became a warehouse and it became huge and it was a lot of saints in there and it was a lot of saints and a lot of people in this place and it was high up it was high up like any warehouse that you may know that can fit a lot of people it was like stadium high and uh, I started to see bubbles of explosion Okay, now that's the best way I can explain this, and this was on the land. Okay, this was on the desert, but meanwhile, while this was going forth, I felt the rattling inside of the inside of the uh, warehouse, and particular saints that I know that will not edify you, you know, because you don't know them, but they were arguing. Okay. These are particular saints that I know, and they were arguing amongst each other. And these are basically um, both leaders. These are leaders, okay? Um, and these two in particular leaders were arguing kind of like, and they were also like side-eyeing each other, like trying to discern each other. But it wasn't God, and it wasn't unity. It wasn't union, and um, nobody was truly, really... Uh, humbling themselves it was like this is my take and that's your take nobody was just like okay let peace come forth and I come in peace nobody chose to walk and yield in uh in the completeness of perfected love and 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 yielding uh to their you know to their opinions flesh and you know their you know their right and your wrong type of you know thing and so um I just was witnessing that off at a distance, like, wow, you know, these are leaders, you know what I'm saying? Now, meaning these are leaders who I look up to, uh, to a degree, okay? Now, um, also, okay, we were like, like when we were high up, it was like elevated, like if as if we were on beds or whatever, and so that's why I was watching and stuff like that, and, and like, okay, now to go back to this desert, because God allowed me to see what went forth on the land. Now, there were like bubbles and these 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 nuclear bombs were like uh neon colors, okay? Uh they were like jumping from here to there and there were explosions and this was all in the desert, okay? Now, I don't know if this made the land, I don't know if this represents for the land being deserted but the land was deserted aside from this warehouse and the 
it was nuclear bombs that were like hovering over I got a chance I can see through it it was transparent but at the same time upon its transparency I could still see the color of these uh, explosions and these colors were neon greenish type colors neon blue okay they were bright and they were like you know is this if it was like a video game but I knew that it wasn't a video game it was very violent and it was a lot of shaking and um this was on the same week that I was given the dream concerning uh, Seattle being bombed by war jets okay so this was given to me twice and when when ge things are given to you know a prophet or a saint you know twice by God that means it's, it is uh, it is vital and so we must take it very seriously if God has told you anything twice it's very vital also if he had showed you this in consecutive days okay or at least you know time again in a very short period okay now God bless you this is the word of the Lord nuclear bombs will be placed uh, they will be dropped on this land okay and uh, I'm sure this is not the first time you heard a prophet say this but this is the first time you heard me say this to the detail that in which God gave it to me okay now God bless you uh, I hope that all the sinners repent and recognize that Jesus Christ is uh, using me and uh, that that you also you know receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior when you hear this message um, I pray that you know uh, that the Saints humble themselves and receive the prophet and many other prophets and prophetess that speak the true words of the Lord uh, that bear witness with your spirit and uh, if it doesn't seek the Lord even harder okay because we're in a time where I don't even want you to just believe me by blind faith but you know seek God and test all the prophecy that I give the Bible says test prophecy every prophetic word that I have given test it seek the Lord okay um, I'm not afraid to say that okay uh, God bless you and um, Jesus is Lord seek him Amen.